Hello, my friends. Ellen here. Hope all you are doing well and staying safe and healthy. Welcome to all my new and returning subscribers to my Southern Kitchen. Today, I'm going to share with all of you one of my favorite pies, key lime pie. It is so refreshing, full of key lime flavor, and as always, it is the bomb.com delicious. And the best part, no mixer and no eggs required. And if y'all a fan of key lime pie, y'all going to love and enjoy this recipe. And I'll post a complete recipe along with the instructions down below in the description box. And also check out my other pie recipes and my previous video, Classic Brunch Mimosas. I'll post a link to those down below in the description box. So grab your graham cracker crust, your sweet condensed milk, and your key lime juice sugar, because we're about to bake some key lime pie magic in my southern kitchen. Here we go! All right, my friends, the first step we're going to do is make our crust. In this bowl, I have one and a half cups of graham cracker crumbs. And we're going to add in a fourth of a cup of white sugar. And a half a cup, which is one stick of melted unsalted butter. I'm going to give these ingredients a quick stir until they're well incorporated and it resembles wet sand. All right, my friends, and just that quickly, our crust is complete. Now we're ready to pour it into the pan. So now we're going to flatten the graham cracker crumbs, like so. And using my measuring cup, we're just going to flat the sides. All righty, our crust is complete, and there's two steps you can do. You can put it in the refrigerator and let it chill for one hour, or you can bake it in the oven. I'm going to bake mine in the oven at 350 degrees and let it bake for eight minutes. Alrighty, my friends, I have taken my graham cracker crust out of the oven, so now I'm going to let this cool completely. And while that's cooling, we can get started on our pie filling. In my large bowl, I'm using two 15 ounce cans of sweetened condensed milk. I already add one can to the bowl, so I'm going to add the other. Ain't nothing like sweetened condensed milk. Love this stuff. And in two hours sweetened condensed milk, we're going to add in a half a cup of sour cream. Two teaspoons of key lime zest. Three fourths of a cup of freshly squeezed key lime juice. One teaspoon of pure vanilla extract and one teaspoon of pure lime extract. Going to give everything a quick whisk until it's well incorporated. Mmm, love the smell of key lime. Smells good. All right, my friends, our key lime pie filling is complete. Nice and creamy and smooth. See how simple and easy it was? All righty, that looks great. Now we're ready to pour into our cool graham cracker crust. Now we're ready to put this key lime pie in the oven. We're going to put it in the same temperature that we baked the crust, 350 degrees, and we're going to let it bake for about 10 minutes. Alrighty, my friends, I have taken my key lime pie out of the oven. Mmm, and it smells phenomenal up in this kitchen. So now I'm gonna let the pie cool slightly, and then after that, I'm gonna place it in the re refrigerator and let it chill until it's firm overnight. Alright, I'll see you tomorrow. All right, my friends, it's the next day and our key lime pie is nice and firm. Now it's time for the final step. I have some homemade whipped cream here with a star piping tip. Just going to pipe all around like so. All righty, and last but not least, 
gonna add some key lime zest. Just like that, isn't that pretty? And there you have it, my friends, key lime pie. Doesn't that look delicious? So now I'm about to fix me up a plate and I'll give it a taste. All right, my friends, I fixed me up a plate and I garnish it with some more key lime zest and a key lime slice right on top. Doesn't that look beautiful? Now it's time for the best part, the tasting. Here we go. Oh yeah. Beautiful texture. Look at that crust. Mm -mm. Mm. Sweet. Tart. Mmm. Bursting with key lime goodness. And that graham cracker crust is spectacular. This green spring and summer. This is awesome, my friends. Please give this recipe a try. This deserves another bite. Yum o. Oh. Key lime pie delicious. My friends, I want to thank all y'all for watching and joining me in my southern kitchen today. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. I really do appreciate it. Don't forget to share this with your family and friends. Like. Comment, subscribe to my channel, and click on the bell so that way you'll be notified when my new videos come out. Also, hashtag Ellen's Homemade Delights on Instagram or send me an email, Ellen's Homemade Delights at gmail.com. I would love to see your beautiful creations with my recipes. I'll see you next time. Let's eat, much love, and stay safe.